Welcome to Fragrance Facts, where I give you truthful and tested details on a fragrance so you guys can learn more about it. So today we're going to talk about my fragrance review on a release by Prada and this fragrance is Luna Rosa Black. Now this fragrance is created by Daniela Roche Adrier. It's a 2018 release. Eau de Parfum Concentration, classified as an Amber Woody. Now, what you're gonna get when we first spray on this fragrance is gonna be this light bergamot citrus with musky, earthy, this angelica patchouli and this spicy cinnamon tonka bean vanilla light powderiness, as well as some amber sweetness. So it's gonna be fresh, earthy, spicy and sweet. When you're in the mid, you're gonna get this musky, earthy, angelica patchouli woods, vanilla tonka bean light powderiness, and a syrupy amber sweetness. So it's gonna be fresh, earthy, woody, and vanilla sweet. In the base, you're gonna get, again, this musky, earthy patchouli with a woody, ambery, vanilla tonka bean. But here, it's not gonna have that powderiness. It's gone. So it's gonna be this musky, earthy, woody, and sweet scent. So it's pretty much the same as the mid, but there are slight differences in which notes stand out. When it comes off to the performance of Luna Rosa Black, off of my skin, I was able to get a little bit more than an arm's length projection for an hour and a half, then it would come closer to the skin. This was a skin scent to me at the six hour mark, and I was able to detect this off of my skin up to 14 hours. When it comes to the scent sillage with trail, I was able to detect this around me up to about six hours on a moderate to low side. So the performance of this fragrance did disappoint me a bit because with all of the ingredients and the darkness that are used in this fragrance, I was expecting to have more performance. This is still a nice performing above average scent. When it comes to the scent profile of this fragrance off of my skin, so I got a pretty linear kind of a scent from beginning to end. Just slight variables that changed. Some notes popped out a bit more than others depending on where you are in the lifetime of the fragrance. There is some powdery aspects to this fragrance. It's gonna be due to that tonka bean. It's gonna be due to the way the vanilla is used. And as well at times that angelica, the way it's made is gonna give it this kind of a bit of a powdery touch. But it's not overly powdery and that powderiness will die down. Actually the angelica is used in here, the way that the tonka bean vanilla is used, it's gonna at times give you a little resemblance to Jean-Paul Gaultier's La Malle. But obviously these are not the same scents at all. This one is darker, it's got the patchouli, it's got woodiness, it's got that ambery touch. And as Jean-Paul Gaultier's La Malle is an aromatic fougère. But it's just to give you an idea of when you do smell it, you're gonna be like, hey, you know, there's a couple of notes here that stick out that does remind me of Jean-Paul Gaultier's La Malle. The scent profile is nice. I do enjoy this. And for the compliment factor off of my skin, guys, I got solid 9 out of 10 reactions with this fragrance. I had women tell me that it smells sexy. And I've actually had a colleague at work that usually wears the typical uh, Aqua Digio's fresh and clean scents and he loved the way this smelled off me and he wanted to know what it was and when I told him that it was a Prada fragrance he was shocked because this guy didn't even think that Prada made fragrances <laughs> so go figure and this fragrance is not a clone of other scents but guys there's a strong resemblances in this type of a fragrance with other ones such as Discontinued Gems Midnight in Paris by Van Cleef and Arpel and another fragrance is going to be by Bulgari and it's the Hockey Puck Bulgari Black. So these fragrances also give you similar vibes to Luna Rosa Black, but they are a bit unique in their own way. They do this type of a family scent in their own unique ways. If you're looking for these fragrances that are discontinued and you want something similar that's gonna work, Luna Rosa Black will do that for you. Thank you very much for watching. See you in the next one. Take care, peace, and lights out.